Hi, this is Ken and Giselle. And welcome to Coffee Pot Cocktails. We're finally back. I know it's been a long time coming. We're a little bit late this year, but the weather has not been very cooperative. No, like many parts of the country here, it seems like it's been raining constantly. Though we're not underwater, many of the areas of the campgrounds here uh, where the RV is located was. So we're back in, we've opened it up, and this is actually our first weekend in. Yeah, we're very excited about uh, trying some new cocktails, uh, something, maybe things that, you know, people haven't really seen before or for a, lo a really long time. But um, we're going to bring back some classics, but some really new things as well. Absolutely, and we're going to continue to try to do it in fun and amusing ways. And just to give you a recap of things that happened towards the end of last year, we're going to start off the season by giving you something that... Uh, Maybe the <laughs> highlights or the lowlights. Uh, Blips and blurbs. <laughs> yeah, somehow this seems to make more fun. This time around, it seems to make more fun of me, I think, than anything else. Uh, I don't know. We'll but have to wait and you'll see. You'll have to wait and see and take a look at it. But look at us putting something out about every two weeks. And uh, hope you enjoy. Uh, and as always, if you have any suggestions or recommendations for cocktails that you'd like to see us do, please do send us a request. We'll be happy to honor all the requests that we get. Our videos are located, of course, on Facebook. Uh, also, YouTube. We try to get it out over, whenever we can, over Instagram as well. So, I hope you enjoy. Uh, subscribe to our YouTube page, Coffee Pot Cocktails. Uh, like us. Subscribe to us. Uh, you'll get uh, a look at all our videos from that link as well. All right, so enjoy. Make it, make it, make it, make it. Oh, I know, a mojito. Oh, that man does love a mojito. All right, this is going to be perfect. As long as I can remember all my ingredients, I'm going to do just great. Right. Okay. Well, Lucy, I'm home. Oh, hello, dear. I'm in here. Hello, dear. Hi, How Lucy. was your day? I had the worst day day ever. Oh, no. Rehearsal just didn't click. I couldn't get my Babalu out right. Oh, dear. Pete broke the skins on his bongos and the backup singers just couldn't be in tune today. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. Here, why don't you go sit down, read your paper, and I'll make you a nice cold mojito. Oh, that would be fabulous. Be very, very quiet. We're hunting cocktails. Ken, that was the creepiest Elmer Fudd I've ever heard. I'm no Mel Blanc. No, you're not. But this is Coffee Pot Cocktails, and I'm Giselle, and this is Ken, and welcome to another edition. Welcome to Coffee Pot Cocktails. This is Rick Sanchez from the Rick and Morty Show. Today we have taken over for Ken and Giselle to bring you this Halloween special. Morty unfortunately could not be with us tonight because he's been grounded since our last adventure in interdimensional space. However, Serenity from C165 has been happy enough to join me and assist me in making this great Halloween Punch. Greetings, friends. I'm happy that you could join us today. So, a few weeks ago, we did an old fashioned where I told everybody that food would taste differently if consumed upside down. And I drank the old fashioned right side up, and everything seemed to be okay, and there hadn't been any problem. But I promised everybody that I would try to try to to, uh, to drink the old fashioned upside down, uh, just to see if there was any difference in in the taste. So can you realize I read that same article and you got it just a little bit wrong? Huh? It was if you taste the food upside down, and not that you're so actually you take a slice of pizza uh -huh. and eat it cheese down as opposed to crust down. 
That's where the flavors change. But you uh, know what? We've got you upside down now. So what? Wait a minute. We're gonna give this a shot. I don't. I don't have to be upside down to change the flavor. Yeah, you do. Let's give it a shot, folks. Check it out. Ah. And what's the verdict? Uh. <laughs> except for the the uh, the part that's kind of running down my nose now. <laughs> Uh, I, I, it, 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 it did taste a little different, but I, I have this urge to really blow my nose right now. So, uh, I think that's probably it. Cut. <laughs> ah! I told you it was going to go up your nose. Don't try this at home. <laughs> was the night before Christmas when all through the house not a creature was stirring not even a mouse and Ken, I don't think we're alone what do you mean we're not alone I think there's more than a mouse stirring around here just the two of us here tonight I don't think so Merry Christmas. Christmas! Hey honey, come check out my Christmas pajamas. Oh, you got new ones? Yeah, what do you think? Oh my God. Wow, I don't think Santa or his reindeer are ready for this. <laughs> it's a onesie. I don't think our friends want to see this. Bye. Well, I hope you enjoyed your trip down memory lane. I don't know. I think it really did kind of make fun of me there, especially that time when I was standing on my head, sitting on my head. You kind of earned that one, I think. Uh, no, I, I kind of dared everybody there. So we're, we're pretty much uh, starting off uh, our weekend uh, by testing out a new cocktail for next week. And then you can look for something every two weeks after that. Uh, this is going to be something that is a whiskey drink uh, so we'll see how that works out and hopefully we'll, we'll be able to incorporate that in a video for next week again please uh, like us on our Facebook page uh, take a look at our YouTube page as well where you'll see the complete collection of all our videos and I hope to uh, see you all soon bye everyone be safe